be supporting the Puma brand. No, you stole my socks. <laughs> you thief. You stole my socks. But then I look at him like, your socks suck. Because <gasps> it's it doesn't have cute color and it doesn't have the cute finish. It's like so dull. You just wanna play game on game? Mm -hmm. All the time. <laughs> Alright, well do an easy hike. Okay, so this video was completely unplanned and I wasn't gonna film anything, but I thought this would be the perfect opportunity to make a short video one of my favorite hikes in North Vancouver. I'm sure you read the title, The Seymour River Suspension Bridge. Yes, I know, another suspension bridge on the North Shore. But hear me out. The houses in this area are super nice. Multi-million dollar homes. And this one even had its own elevator lift. No idea what it would have cost to do that. But I thought it was pretty neat. Generally speaking, I just enjoyed looking at homes I'll probably never ever be able to afford to buy. So I don't know if that's what you like to do, but I actually like to do that. <laughs> this is just the guest house? Looks like it goes down. Pretty cool. Anyways, why I love the Seymour River Suspension Bridge is because it's less crowded than the Lynn Canyon Suspension Bridge. See, it connects to all the falls. You went here before. Mm -hmm. You went here before. You've been all over the, been all over the place. I don't think you know what you're looking at. Yeah, I don't even know where we're at. You are here at the very bottom. Where? Oh, I'm here? Okay. So, we're here. We're gonna go up here. All the way up here, all the way up here, and then go to this bridge, and then we're going to go up this bridge. Wait, hang on. Somewhere we can just punch the bridge. Wait, never mind. I don't know what I'm doing. We were short on time, so I won't be going over all the trails in the area, but there's a lot to choose from. You have the big ones like the Baton Powell Trail, Fisherman's Trail and at least a dozen other trails in the area. The hike to the Seymour River Suspension Bridge is really easy and the most popular. At times it can feel like you're 30 stories over the river, so it can be pretty neat. Holy, it's so far. Can't even see it. It scares me if you're there, because this is like, remember like a couple of years ago there was a rock slide in North Vancouver? This is it. This is where the rock slide was? Yeah. Do you see this? This, this was open like late, late last year. Oh, did it? Yeah. They closed it for like two years or a year, more than a year because of the rock slide. Oh. Yeah. So the Seymour River Suspension Bridge isn't as interesting as in the Capilano or the Lynn Valley Suspension Bridge, but the surrounding trails are definitely worth visiting. Alright, so this is it. This is one of my favorite trails in North Vancouver. Definitely underrated and totally beautiful. You should check it out. Ultimately, I wanted to show you the sandy beach down by the river but they seem to have closed it off. Perfect beach and it's closed. It's sandy beach. Watch this thing. You can sort of see the beach area from the main trail heading to the Seymour River suspension bridge, but for whatever reason it was closed off when we went. 
So that's the sandy beach we're trying to get to. Trails closed and overgrown. There it is. Oh well. We are making that eat the orange cake. Ooh, that looks good. I like this recipe because it tells you to include the skin. Oh, so you don't have to worry about it? Yeah. Looks good. I kind of want to keep the smaller one, honestly. Cooking dance? <laughs> no! Let's see the cooking dance. <laughs> Stop! <laughs> Man, look at you. Macho, macho man. They call me Mr. Macho Man. Macho Man. <laughs> macho Man. When you call me Mr. Macho Man. Like that? Mm hmm. Okay, Mr. Macho, do the dishes. <laughs>